Hey guys, it's Tisha. This is not the video that I was intending on uploading today, but I felt important enough to make a video about it. Let's get started. Okay, so for the past couple of months, people have been stealing my videos, altering them, and then uploading them on YouTube again. 50 times. I've had to make 50 claims in the past two months. It is ridiculous. I don't know what people are doing with these videos, but they're not giving me credit for them. Obviously, they want the views for themselves. Here's the issue. I worked hard on my videos, I edit them myself, and then I upload them on my own channel. I consider this stealing. Stop stealing my videos. But this isn't what I'm talking about today. No, 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 no. One of my viewers contacted me and they said, hey, you should really check out this article that was written about you. I'm like, all right, you know, articles are written about me all the time. Here's the thing. Here's the title. If you think you suffer in life, do you suffer as much as she does? What? I am not suffering. And I really want everyone to understand that. I do not suffer. There are children in Africa who are starving. They are suffering. There are over 90,000 homeless people in California. They are suffering. I am not suffering. I go through challenges and I struggle, but I am not suffering in any way, shape, or form. I am happy. I've got, you know, food in my stomach and a roof over my head, and that's all that I could ever ask for. Just because I don't have arms doesn't mean that I'm suffering in life. The article goes on. If you think you're unhappy, look at them. Them? They show my video, they've altered it, and then they've uploaded it without sourcing where they got the video from, which is rude, by the way, okay? And then they take screenshots of my videos, one of me driving and the other of me pumping gas, and then they seem to have claimed that these are two different people. No, no, it is me. They're both me. He just took two different shots from my videos. Them. Do you sometimes feel that the universe is out to get you? Or you think that you are one of those people who are always suffering setbacks? Let me tell you a secret. You are luckier than a lot of other people. No crap. I mean, I think we all have that feeling where you should just feel lucky that you're alive and, and that there are other people that have more setbacks than you. But that's not an excuse to exploit people with disabilities for your website. Moving on. The amazing moments of girls born without hands can live happily and do everything by themselves. Again, they are referring me as two different people. Not to mention that this article is poorly written. And to conclude, enjoy life how it is and as it comes. There are worse for others and is a lot better for us. Whoever wrote this is saying that they are better than me because they have arms. Who gives them the right to write an article about me, one, without asking permission, two, telling everyone in the world that I am suffering and that everyone who has arms is better than me and that you guys should look up to the skies and heavens and thank God that you have arms because not having arms is a disgrace is a curse, is suffering. I wrote to them and I told them to take the post down. They have not taken the post down and they're still using my videos and my photos to gain views or, or subscribers or whatever. It's, it's absurd. I don't like it. And I wish they would stop using my videos because I work hard on them. I work hard to create them for you guys, to upload them and edit them and to show everyone that I'm not suffering. And then this happens. I don't get it. So if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. Go ahead and kick that subscribe button. And uh, if you feel the need, <laughs> contact that person and let them know what you think of their article because, no. Jess, I wanna know if this has happened to you before and what you've done to, uh, to battle that issue. Alright guys, I will see you next week.